only which means you can only use what we've got mm. can't have it open fire mm. <laughs> it's beautiful here so we are at the starting point of the track um, on the right hand side you can see the lake Dobson which is a beautiful here um, so we actually up the high of a thousand and forty meters um, and the summit it's gonna be 1434 that means we got about 430 something meters to walk Craig found some snow pad over there. He's making a snowball. Throw it. So here's a hut where you can actually take a shelter. How can I actually? How can I actually open this? Pull that down. Oh, here we go. <laughs> it's beautiful. Very cozy. Here you got a bed. If you want to lay down, have a rest. You also have upstairs as well. Beautiful. Goodies. And here is our Goodies. lunch yeah. view. Nice. Beautiful. Would you like a popper?
so we finally made it on the summit of the Mount View West the view from here is amazing and we got a very good luck with the weather mm. very quiet and still um, so that's why you can see the view from here is just mind-blowing mind-blowing mind and as Hong says, this is the best view that she has had so far this year Ah, uh, in Tasmania. Yeah, or would be in something all the places I've been before. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> but anyway, it's worth it. You've got to say for the Australian audience, this is the best place on earth. Um, well, big yeah, statement. We spent about over four hours to get here. And so far, at the moment, it's actually 4.30, quarter to five. Oh, it's almost five. It's almost five. So we uh, should head off soon and get back mm. to the car park or else it's going to get dark. It's probably not going to get dark until nine, but we still need dinner before nine anyway. So, yeah. So um, for now, just Signing take off. as much as we can. The Rundi. view. And then we're going to get back to the car park. Mm. Hello everyone, thank you for watching this video, especially if you have reached this far to this talking part, that means you have already finished my whole second part of the road trip in Tasmania to Christmas 2019. Um, I really appreciate your time and honestly I hope that you enjoy the video uh, as the way I did when I sat down and rewatched the whole journey by myself. In fact, I actually did that more than once. So I guess I would like to have about five minutes talk about the uh, walk in this video in particular, which is the Mount View West uh, track uh, located in the Mount View National Park. One thing I have to say that I am not a serious hiker. Um, I would love to do that more often, but uh, living in Melbourne and having a full-time job just they just don't have um, and hopefully that I can have more chance to actually do that in the, the future um, but that's why uh, I have to explain that because um, to me the Mount View West track is actually quite a bit of challenge uh, the whole trail is about 19 or 20 kilometers and it estimated to uh, take about uh, eight or nine hours in return to finish the whole track, but in reality, we uh, it actually took us about m roughly nine point five or ten hours to finish the whole track. Um, as you can see, that I actually quite often I stop and take footage and images as well. As you could have seen, uh, we started from Lake Dobson Car Park and then go through the Snow Gum Track and then uh, follow the boat walk along the uh, Tarn Shelf Track. The weather was amazing. We couldn't wish for anything better than that. Um, we, we can see a lot of tarns, a lot of cans and patches of rocks all along the way. Um, one of the highlights on the walk uh, to me definitely has to be mentioned which is the Keiku Hut if that's the way uh, they call it um, where we sat down and have lunch and from there you can have a 60 degree view over the distance um, and talking about lunch we actually underestimate the length of the track and because of this we run out of the food supply even before we get into the summit um, we literally have uh, run out of water as well and that's why we had to survive uh, based on the water from the tarns and also the water from the blocks of ice that we fell on the ground which is quite cool and such a great experience to me I actually never done that meal is actually not the only thing we underestimate uh, we uh, the timing also uh, are the factor that we didn't consider that very properly we didn't start the track until 11 30 in that morning and um, by the time we get into the submit is already like 5 p.m. or so and it took the same amount of time to go back to the camping site so you can imagine um, by the time we got there it already dark and we end up having dinner at about 9 30 which is a totally dark um, I think if we could have done anything differently on the track um, we would start it earlier I know a lot of uh, group they have started from 
I except even 7 in the morning so which is a very good way to do that another great thing about the track is that you can see a lot of cool attractive vegetation um, soon as you enter this summit plateau you can see a lot of um, uh, they call it cushion grass I believe uh, they are very colorful and they are also very fragile so you really have to be careful where you lay your steps on otherwise you will cause uh, them a permanent uh, damage um, I know a lot of people actually didn't care about that which, which is I need to mention um, so and they are very pretty they're just everywhere um, and of course the best highlight of the walk is the view from the summit of the map view west um, from there you can have another 360 degree view um, you can just see mountain after mountains in I know if a lot of people know uh, different mountain in Tasmania they can actually name it correctly um, we spent about 30 45 minutes on top of that mountain I, and I have to say that um, I couldn't get enough of it it just mind-blowing and I say in the video overall the track is actually very easy um, it's not really challenging it's just the length itself is actually quite uh, fitness requiring uh, other than that I think anyone can do that um, you just need to um, I think that we just need to prepare more water um, if we um, know that how long it would could have taken other than that I will do it again and hopefully that you guys enjoy the trip as well and hopefully you found it um, inspiring enough um, to maybe get yourself there um, if you haven't done that yourself and if you like the video just click the like and also subscribe as well if you want to fo keep following um, more videos from my road trip um, or either Tasmania or Victoria or anywhere in Australia bye for now